Hey YouTube, this is this Hawk. 7 a.m. Heading over to the Asda Express Grand Opening. It's about a six minute walk. Very excited. The weather is not too bad on this December morning. Pretty warm, I'd say. Really brisk. Turning the corner. Traffic. Coming up on the side of the building. Very impressed with those hours. 7 a.m. to 12 a.m. As the Express. It would appear they are not open at 7. I do not know what time they are going to be open. The visit to Azza has been unsuccessful, which is a shame. I now see that people are being redirected to the Tesco Express. The old man on the street, if you will. I'm now walking home after waiting in the front for a while. I finally was able to ask an employee to learn that the opening is at 10 a.m. Which in my opinion is quite late for a grand opening. Especially when the sign says it's open at 7 a.m. The second thing is that no information has been conveyed on the sign. So that people like me could now wake up at 7 a.m. and head over to the Asda Express. Overall, not impressed with this experience, although it is a nice brisk morning for a good walk. Heading home, as you can see, which is what I would call an unsuccessful trip. Now a quite sad element of this trip is that I will not be available to attend the grand opening at 10 a.m. because I will be volunteering today at a farm. Yes, today I will not be visiting the groceries because I'll be visiting the goats. Now in this elevator. Heading home. Hey YouTube, this is Hawk. It's now 4 p.m. Just got back from the farm and I'm heading over into the Asa Express on my way home. There it is. Hello, I'll meet. Got a croissant for Sidra. Leaving the Azda now. Overall, good experience. Need to do a 
check on the prices to see how much they are in comparison to other stores. Definitely are more expensive than normal as the price is, but I think on par with or cheaper than the Tesco Express. It's quite big in there, quite modern. Uh, I'm pretty happy with the overall experience. Happy about the all meat as well. We'll definitely need to purchase it so they continue to restock it because that means that halal meat is right around the corner. As someone who has just been to a farm, I now understand the appreciation of animals. And while I did not slaughter any of the chickens, I did transport ducks from one stable to another. Have a good day.